Hi everybody, welcome to another edition of IntelliTips with Dino from Machine Tools Online. Today we're working on our new IntelliPack Series 2, 125 ton by 3200 millimeter NC press brake. This machine is capable of bending up to 6 millimeter mild steel across the full 3.2 millimeter length. Today what we're going to do is pick up on where we were in IntelliTips episode 1, where we went through the E21 control and checked all of its parameters and I explained the meaning of all of them. Today what we're going to do is do a short little program so you can understand how to program the NC control. I'm going to start the machine up, set it correctly, let's take a closer look. As you can see, the machine is currently set for position X at 200 and position Y which is the depth of our beam at 128.5. I'm going to change the setting in single mode to do a single bend. Let's change X to 250 and let's change Y to 128. We push execute on the control and the machine will set itself up ready for the bend. Okay. So that's our single mode program, very simple. What we'd like to do now is set up a multi-step program. We do that by coming out of single mode by pressing P, or stop rather, and then pressing P, which takes us to the programming screen. Here you have access to up to 40 programs with 25 steps in each, and every step can be repeated 99 times. Let's have a look at program 1 which I set up earlier. You can see program 1 has got 5 steps programmed and we've completed one complete set of steps. If I push the side arrow, I step into the program and go to the first step. It shows our current position of X and Y, but it also shows our programmed positions for X, Y, retraction and how many times we may repeat that step. If I press to the side again, I will go to step 2, step 3, step 4, step 5, and then I'll return to step 1. But I'd like to set up my own three-step program, and I'm going to do that in slot number 2. Let's shift over there now. Push enter on slot 2, and I'm able to see that there is already a program there I'd like to overwrite. Pressing 0 for the steps, will overwrite all of the steps and set it to zero. I'm then able to go back to the step parameter and set it for my desired number of steps, which will be three in this case. Let's press enter. Now we can go to the first step. On step one, I would like to leave the machine in its current position, so I'll just cheat and take the current X position as 250, program it in. I can then also cheat and take the Y position is 127.99 and program it in, it's 128. For the sake of it, I'll just put it in again for us. Then I would like to have the back gauge retract as I'm doing a bend, and I shall set that to 20 millimeters. And that is it, that's our first step program. I can then go to step number two and say, let us set our back gauge at 200. Shift to that parameter switch it to 200 and press enter. I can then change my depth to 127 and I can set my retraction to zero for that particular step. Finally, I can move to step three. On step three, I would like my X position to be 100. I would like my Y position to return to 128 and I'd like my retraction to be 10. And there I have fulfilled all three of my steps. I can now push P, which will take me back to the home screen for that particular program, and push my execute button, which will start the program running. If I now press my down pedal, the machine will carry out step one. As you can see, the back gauge and the beam depth are set automatically. I can now press for step two. And finally, 
once the machine has set itself correctly, I can press for step number three. And that's all there really is to it.